What would you do to have a pair of glasses that is not only powered by augmented reality but also synchronizes with your phone to show you things such as your emails, texts, a map of wherever you are, or gives you directions for where you're headed all of these without you even having to pull out your phone well? These are some of the things that the Apple glasses will help you do, but what if I tell you that the Apple glasses will also conform to anyone's prescription needs? And that's why thousands of people like me have been waiting excitedly for these eyewear for many, many years now, but unfortunately we will have to wait longer well till at least 2025. But what are the other things to expect from the Apple glasses that make this eyewear so special? And could the Apple glasses be the product that eventually replaces the iPhone? History of the Apple glasses This story began way back in 2014, when thousands of spyglass lovers around the globe were heartbroken because of Google's with the Apple Glass. According to Tim Badger and Apple didn't start developing the smart glasses immediately after the Worldwide Developers Conference. Instead, Apple took a systematic approach by creating software applications that could be delivered on iPhones and iPads. These applications will eventually be used on the Apple Glass. We could assume that apart from making the tech world happier Apple's technological strides are largely in effect because they are trying to introduce a perfect glass model to the world. And as we can see from the indefinite postponement Apple isn't ready to risk the tiniest floor in its most ambitious project. If Apple gets things right, it could result in a profitable expansion of the AR market for life. What's more, it will make people believe that a device as unique as this could be more than just science fiction or what you see in a superhero movie. The third and fourth quarter of 2022 was greeted with several rumors and speculations about Apple Glass as a sufficient battery life to sustain it. Many of the things we know about the design of the Apple Glass are from leaked patterns, some of which illustrate Apple Glass as a safety wearable, but if Apple is going to steal the hearts of millions of Apple-centric people with the smart glasses, then it has to be fashionable. Aside from its technical qualities, People want to look cool on Apple Glass and not like some two-decade-old Terminator at. No offense, Arnold. Nonetheless Apple has in the past displayed sleekness and style in its designs from the earliest to the most recent. And we can say based on this fact, that the design of Apple Glass might not be disappointing. Why in May 2022, Apple analyst John Prosser suggested that Apple Glass will look like the pair worn by its founder Steve Jobs with respect to some sort of heritage edition. Wouldn't that be nice however, Apple sleuth. Mark German says that John Pross's disclosure could well be a rumor moreover Tim Cook hasn't said anything about the glasses except heaping praises on the prospects of augmented reality. To say the least, the design for Apple Glass wouldn't be different from your normal glasses. Going by the pictures we've seen on the internet the eyewear will have a light detection and ranging scanner, also known as LiDAR scanner on the right temple. This scanner will help the user create fast, accurate and realistic 3D representations of close-range objects and environments. However, the Apple glasses do not come with any inbuilt cameras. Still LiDAR helps position objects without physical markers in seconds the first generation of Apple Glass will also come with a stand and a wireless charging dock. The battery life is also expected to be around 3 hours. But if charging the Apple Glass would be as easy as charging AirPods then the short lifespan wouldn't be much of a problem. Apart from the glasses. The lenses are also another feature that make the Apple Glasses pretty special special lenses. One of the major things to expect from the Apple Glass are its special lenses. Apple has been granted a patent that reveals that the smart glasses will accommodate all eye conditions despite their severity. Using an optical subassembly, Apple Glass will automatically adjust to the user's eyesight however, several analysts claim that this feature is likely to be used in developing the augmented and virtual reality headset that Apple has picked over the development of smart glasses. And if not, perhaps we'll get to see it in the second edition of Apple Glass. Another patent shows that Apple is making attempts to increase user experience by projecting the image right into the user's eye. This way it becomes way easier to focus on particular images. This feature however, doesn't prevent the smart glasses from doubling as prescription glasses. Also, going by a 2019 CNET report which indicated that the Apple glasses would project in 8K, users can expect a stunning 7680 by 4320 pixel. Resolution for each eye if and only if, the report turns out to be true several other patents. 
Suggest that Apple Blast can project parts of the world you wish to see allows you to change. Background seamlessly and for the secret government agents watching this video, Apple. Blast depth sensors will aid night vision there are also talks of Apple Blast having a privacy. Eyewear feature that keeps your iPhone display private. But more importantly, another patent. Has revealed wearables in the form of smart rings that will aid finger movement and gestures. To which Apple smart glasses must work accordingly let's say you're using a pen for instance well an Apple pen the smart rings will help translate whatever movements you make with your fingers into handwritten text. And according to Apple sleuth Ming-Chi Kuo, the Apple Glass may use Sony Micro OLED displays and optical modules to improve its see-through AR experience and in the same vein provide an impressive VR experience Apple Glass. Privacy Going back to privacy, one of the major problems with Apple Glass might be the idea that users can record or photograph people without their knowledge. And I guess Hollywood has made us aware of this fact. When Google Glass came out in 2013, a Seattle bar called the Five Points Cafe publicly banned the use of Google Glass from their premises for the same reason. Apple didn't need to have that experience with their HMDs before protecting people's privacy so they got a patent that allowed for recording indicators to alert bystanders when they're being recorded. However, this patent is more suitable for Apple's AR VR headset, since Apple didn't install an extra camera on Apple Glass. And even if we're taken by surprise, we can be sure that both users and bystanders' privacy is protected also the patent suggests a removable camera accessory module. Its absence signifies the HMD user cannot record. It also provides theaters and bars like the Five Point Cafe leverage against illegal. Filming or photographs Apple Glass may detect sound elite patents suggest that the Apple Glass features several microphones that helps it detect even the littlest sound and lead the user to the detected sounds via an indicator. AR Kit We already know that Apple has been in the business of AR for years and each version of iOS contains newer AR features. And as I said earlier these captivating features are a systematic approach to Apple's most ambitious AR tech. Going forward location anchors on the AR kit will allow Apple Glass users to affix AR objects to real-world locations in other words sporting Apple Glass or Apple's mixed reality headset will allow you to see these objects without physical interaction. Objects like location signs. Directions in almost everything you see daily also, Apple Glass users can create a 3D map of a specific location in seconds using captured depth data and anchor points. Apple has also added face and hand tracking software to the AR kit. With it, users can expect an immersive gaming experience, and they'll also be able to translate sign language. Apple Glass software and price. It's been rumored that Apple is already developing two AR VR platforms. The first is based on iOS Reality Operating System, also known as ROS, which suggests it will only work on your iPhone and the other on macOS Extended Reality Operating, also called ROS. And as the name implies, it will only work on your MacBook. So the Apple Glass is likely to use the ROS. In addition to this, a 2020 leak reveals that the Apple Glass will employ an operating system codenamed Starboard. Interestingly, back in 2019, a few codes were discovered inside the builds of Apple's iOS 13 with the codename Starboard or StarTester. As I've said over and over again Apple relies on a series of developing systems for its latest technology. But whilst we can go on and on about the interesting features of the Apple Glasses, one important question is would you be able to afford it? John Prosser discloses that the Apple Glass will cost $499 separate from the cost of prescription lenses. The lenses are likely to be custom-made so depending on your insurance plans, you're likely to spend around $1,500 in total. And that's quite a pretty penny. So what is Apple doing now? News about the Apple Glass's indefinite postponement isn't complete without talking about its replacement, the mixed reality headset. Apple explains that the combined augmented and virtual reality headset will be a stepping stone to the development of the Apple Glass. Earlier patents have shown that the headset will come with specialized gloves. The mixed reality headset is likely to be launched this year, and a second generation, which will be much lighter and rumored to be able to take calls, will be out in 2024. And let's not forget Apple's AR contact lenses, which analysts believe will be launched in 2030.
And hopefully after this, you'll be able to cop the Apple Glass from your favorite stores. Thanks for watching subscribe for more amazing content.